I can't believe that I left. I remember you leaving. Yep. You've never come back. Never, not one time. Never. Why would I come back? I mean, so... you're right. Your parents were down we, there We've by kept then. in touch. I mean, we... I guess your brother. Oh, he was a dick. I told him. No, he's not a nice guy. <laughs> Do you talk to him ever? No. He hangs out with my parents. I don't know what my parents have told him. My parents are just toxic. You don't talk to them? No. They did horrible things to me throughout these, you know, years in Atlanta, and I just let it go and let it go, because those are your parents, right? So they can do no wrong. And finally, I woke up and was like, you know what? I'm done playing with you guys. My mom would charge me as a single mom to watch my kids at night. A hundred dollars to watch my kids at night so I could work as a nurse. Like, it was terrible. When I saw my daughter crying over what my parents put in the media. Kim's mother recently spoke out about her not being able to see her grandchildren. <laughs> their family, they're not supposed to do that. I said, that's it. You will never have the ability to ever come and hurt my children or me. Just because they're parents doesn't mean that they're good parents. But I didn't realize that, that right. until like, I went through just so much, and it was like, this. But do you think you could salvage anything? No, I don't. No. no. You, you f my kids, yeah, and that's I'm it. Like... I think it's hard for anybody to understand that a child doesn't have a relationship with their parents. But to these people, you know, my mom was cool. She was fun. She was young. She was pretty. So they can't quite comprehend it, probably more so than the average person. But um, I mean, I don't think anybody truly understands it. I mean, she's going to be 18. Like, we have to blow it out. And I don't even really know what that means. Blow it out. Like, it's her 18th birthday. Like, she's 18. It's huge.